Okay, so we're all ready to do this already? That, that's pretty cool. Um, what's next stage? Oh, what was that about? No, castle. Cool. Um, pretty sure I get through this time. Welcome. Oh, I skipped through all of that because I already dealt with all of that before because I died and now I'm doing it again. So that's always cool. Um, let's see. What's, what's happening? Nothing. So let me see. Uh, this is, after this one, I'll have just two more videos to do. And then I shall be done with this batch as far as commentary goes. Not sure I'm gonna be able to do the get the audio cleaned up before I go to sleep. Um, but at least I'll have all the commentary did. I'll probably be spending uh, the following day. Let's see. The following day after I record all this. Uh, after I I'm going to wake up, clean up the audio, and then I'm gonna just going to let everything render. Um, pretty much as far as that goes, I'm going to clean up the... Uh, yeah, I'm going to clean up the audio. Uh, then record a bunch of filler Game Boy... Shitty Game Boy filler videos for stuff in between the Final Fantasy Tactics Advanced stuff. And then... What, what, what am I going to do from there? I'm either going to be editing those or laying down commentary, but after I... I'm probably going to... It's probably going to be quick to finish rendering all of the stuff. I just, like, commentary down for tonight because it's, like, only 14 videos. And for the most part, it's all just uh, Guilty Gear Judgment stuff. So then I'll probably just end up... You know, I'm, I'm going to be editing something. I'm going to be editing this, editing that, doing commentary for something. Either one of those, but I'll be doing it, I'll be working on it, and all that good stuff. So either way, I'm going to be staying busy working on something tomorrow. Unless I do happen to somehow. Uh, somebody invites me out to do something. Uh, I've already sent out a couple messages. Hey, anybody doing something, anything going on? And I haven't gotten anything, anything in response. No cool shows or events going on tonight, or this weekend as far as I know of. Um, unfortunately... So that doesn't look like an option. And like, what was it? Yesterday, I could have actually... I was thinking about it. I, I'm, I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of Nappy Roots. I've, you know, paid attention to them here and there over the years. But like, I'm not a huge fan of them. But, uh... You know, they were in town last night. And if I would have went, then I could have met some pretty hot, cute... A uh, local Chicago model. I'm not really one of my more favorite Chicago land models, but you know she's she's good. Um, not really one of my preferences either. Italian dime piece. I mean she's fly as shit and thick as fuck, but um, I don't know. She's okay. As far as my favorite Chicago land model goes, though, she's more low key. Low key. She's not as I don't think she's, like, anywhere near as popular, but, uh, Amy and Amnesia, uh, she's actually the one who got me into local Chicagoland models, or just models in general, just checking out models and watching how they're doing and keeping track and keeping up to date on, you know, models you can actually fucking talk to and shit. But I've pushed her shit for years, I've put all her stuff on StumbleUpon, uh, when I first started my Tumblr, I spammed the shit out of Tumblr with everything I had of her. Um, and then I kind of, like, stopped paying attention for a while, kind of forgot, kind of, you know, ended up not keeping track of her. But, um, then I finally got a hold of, you know, I caught up on her la later last year, you know, she, because when I first came across her, she had her Facebook, and, uh, we were, she didn't have a fan page yet. And we were actually Facebook friends for a brief period. I think I finally spammed her when I was stupid, not paying attention to stuff, um, and then, you know, I, a couple days later, I noticed, I think I spammed everybody on my friends list, and then, you know, I noticed after the fact that I think she, uh, defriended me from that, 
Jump kind of sad that, you know, we aren't actual Facebook friends anymore. But we do talk sometimes on, you know, the different social networks. So she's really cool. She's definitely more experimental, more creative, more artistic. Because, like, a lot of the just models in the area is just, like, normal, boring, oh, model in a swimsuit. Show those curves. And she's more, like, bondage and ropes and chains and off-the-wall, weird, experimental, abstract. It's very fucking sexy, too. Um, I mean, she doesn't, she's not there. She don't have them curves. But... She makes up for it in other features. And she's Asian, not white. So that's even a bonus for me. Um, but definitely one of my favorites. Um, and, you know, if, if uh, Italian Dime Piece was mixed something, like mixed Hispanic, because she almost looks like she could be mixed Hispanic and passport, but she's not. So, unfortunate. Um, otherwise, you know, Amy Amnesia, as far as the Chicagoland model, she's pretty fucking dope. The models who work with uh, DYE Life, uh, like, you know, clothing brand or whatever they're doing now, I'm not even sure what's up with them. I think they do, like, some artistic clothing. Um, they're okay, they're cool, but, you know, for the most part, I don't know, they don't do a whole lot of experimental weird shit anymore too often, really. Um, kind of sad about that, because I do like, I do enjoy the more artistic, weird, off-the-wall stuff. Like, one of my more favorite, um... Because I only really know them by their, uh, their own personal names, not if they, if they have any, ma uh, um, um, modeling aliases, like Amy Amnesia. But, uh, I don't know, I'd really like to see, uh, Amy Amnesia blow up and do, do, take off with that and just do that professionally instead of, you know, just her one day job, but, uh, you know, we'll see. So I do like to keep, atten keep track of uh, models, though. See what they're up to. See what they're doing. See how they're staying busy. See what kind of new good shit they can do off the wall with. Um, and I wish uh, Amy Amnesia was more into hip-hop rather than her death metal music. But, you know, she, that doesn't affect my how how she's a favorite of mine, so... So good. I, I start. I think I started paying attention to her like three or four years ago or so. Um, back when she was still jailbait. And I didn't even realize she was jailbait then. Back then, I don't think. Either way, she's awesome. Um, if you're into keeping track of models, you can definitely find her on stuff. Amy Amnesia. You can just search it up on Facebook. You'll see it. But she's really fucking awesome. And all that good stuff. So. Uh, coming to an end of this video. It was kind of lengthier than most of them, but this was also lengthy anyway, so. Yep. On to next stuff. One more.